And now the policeman that was critical in the case has been revealed to have been tainted by some of, of, of his, let's say, other than ethical behavior. So not only did the judge release him, give him bail, they overturned the conviction. And even when the DA last week, Ari said, the Philadelphia DA said that he should be given a new trial because of the compromise of the uh, police officer that was the arresting officer, the judge still wouldn't let him out of jail. This woman judge had a uh, bent that against him from the beginning. When I visited him in jail, that's what he talked about. But he also talked about this is about a, the, the parole system and how a judge can have this kind of awesome power. He said, Reverend, I want to fight for others, and my case is a symbol. His release is a symbol that we can win, and I know that he will be committed to helping us fight for others. Nigga, I know, I know, nigga. Do you remember I told you, nigga, not to take that 10 years of probation, nigga? <laughs> I told you not to take that. I said, man, ask them people if you can go and do two years right quick. <laughs> hey, man. But she. But... Hey, man, be honest with you, man. You really walked that shit down, Ben. I could have. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie to you. I had a five and I went back to prison twice, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. Now, really, what happened was, well, nigga, you got you you became a household name. That really what happened. You know what I'm saying? Like before, like before, motherfuckers felt like you had to, you had to, you had to be a fan of rap to know who the fuck you were. Then you became a household name. Callie, what's up? You look like you got tall, Callie. What's up? How you doing? How you doing? Callie, you said I'd be back soon, too. This is... 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 This